Hey everyone, it's Amy. Today I'm going to be putting away a bunch of my new photo cards. I think what I want to do, because I normally start out with my mini binders, I'm gonna do the larger binders first. So I'd like to start out with Luna because yesterday I received a package from Melanie. She and I split the Lunaverse concert photo cards and um, she just sent me those. So I'm gonna put away, well, I'm just gonna do a bias line like I normally do. I'm gonna put Lunaverse on this page. So I am still missing quite a bit. Um, if you're new or if you just forgot <laughs> who I collect in Luna, I collect Jinsel, who is my main bias, as well as Goan and Heejin. I used to collect Cherry, but I collect Heejin now. Um, but I actually got really lucky that I have a Jinsel and Cherry unit card in here too. But anyways, uh, each member I think has four photo cards and then there are units as well. And Melanie actually pulled um, my bias line in units, so that was really exciting. So, oh, they also have really, really pretty backs. Like, isn't that just absolutely breathtaking? They always have the best backs for like special events. So I think I will just, for now, <laughs> I don't know how I want to store these honestly, but I'm just gonna go ahead and put uh, the units in the middle like so and we're just gonna try to fill out a nine pocket page for the time being until I can collect the rest of the cards that I'm missing so I think I'm gonna put like corresponding backs together on the same row so I think this one since Jinsel has that back and this go on matches and then these two have this back, which is really, really beautiful. They'll go down over here. And then uh, the pack of photo cards came with like these little filler pieces of paper. So I thought for now, I can stick them in here and just have them be temporary fillers. So yeah, not bad. And hopefully I can do some trades. But either way, don't you think the back looks really nice so far? I'm really happy with it. I'm not sure how hard it's going to be to do some trades. I still need to post that on my Instagram. But yeah, anyways, that is all I think that I have for Luna today. I just went ahead and I grabbed a whole bunch of pockets that I'm going to be needing for BTS. Uh, <laughs> I feel like this binder is already getting really, really full. So this binder is sort of like my OT7 slash more rare individual Taeyong cards. Well, larger inclusions for him, I should say. And then Tae has his own separate photo card binder. I might need to reorganize or restructure some things. And I'm kind of thinking about maybe getting just a totally separate smaller binder for mini tour photo cards or just mini photo cards in general. Um, so yeah, we'll see how that goes. But anyways, um, I have these from Permission to Dance in Seoul. Uh, we have the deco package that I just unboxed. Yeah, spoiler, I pulled Tay. <laughs> so that was really exciting. But I decided to split out Tay's stuff from the deco package. And his stuff is going to uh, go into his own binder. So let's see how I want to do this. <laughs> I think I'm going to put all these OT7 cards. I love these a lot. They're double-sided. They're so pretty. I want to put them in this binder, I think, as well as their Polaroids and the stickers that they drew. Just think they're really, really cute. Okay, and then I have the Permission to Dance in Seoul um, photo cards. And since each member only has four, I can put them in an eight pocket. Well, at least I'm going to do Tay and JK, the two main biases and the wrecker. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's what we're going to do. As you can see, we have TXT in here as well. So, okay, <laughs> just trying to get my bearings here. I organized this a couple of days ago. Well, maybe more like a week ago now. And a lot of this sort of slipped my mind on how I wanted to organize everything. Let's see, we are okay, I'm gonna have to go into the very back of this section. I am so sorry if my camera 
is jiggling because I keep hitting the desk. I know, I am so sorry. All right, I was just testing something out and if I unsleeve these message cards, I can put them into a six pocket and I honestly think I'm just going to do that. I don't think it's super necessary for me to even sleeve these but they won't fit <laughs> if I keep the sleeves on them. These are like tarot size sleeves, which you can find from the brand BCW. So I'm just gonna remove these. You know what, it's fine. These pockets are um, PVC free anyway, so it's fine. And we will go in order. This is such a mess. <laughs> uh, where is Jin? Where's Yoongi? There he is. <laughs> and I don't know. I just really like how nice and organized these six pockets are. And they won't slide around. And I am going to put Tay in here with them. Okay. And then when we flip it over, you can see their messages. Oh geez, I'm probably going to put JK up here though, because he might look a little funny if I put him on his own page by himself. <laughs> so that's okay though. We'll put him there. Okay, let me go through the permission to dance cards. Oh, this is from the hoodie. I forgot that I had the hoodie. So one, two, three, four. That's Tay. One, two, three, four. This is JK. Okay, let's just go in order. <laughs> Why not? Um, number one, number two, and then number three, and four. And I think it'd be nice to have JK here, um, you know, since he is my wrecker and it'd be cute to have them on the same page. So here's number one. Two, three, and four. Oh gosh, this one looks kind of strange. I think I want to uh, maybe turn him. Okay, that's a little better. Oh, that is so cursed though that the font goes the other way. <laughs> uh, that's okay, that's okay. All right, and now this is the special pack. And uh, we just have seven here, so. I might go grab a six pocket, but I have seven cards here so I can put the other one up here at the top. Sorry, my brightness is just <laughs> a little off today. So I don't know what card I should put here. I'm thinking maybe just this one because it is a vertical. So let's just put it up there. And these I am not really, I think, going to go in any particular order. Like I'm not going to go in numerical order, um, but I was thinking let's see maybe we can do the hoodie cards uh, like this and then the group okay so that's how we're gonna do this how does it look on this side yeah it looks fine <laughs> okay now we can go on finally into the deco package oh my goodness Let's see, Polaroids and everything. Okay, put that aside for now. I am going to just do um, photo cards. And like I said, Tay is going to be uh, in his own. So we'll just do a six configuration like that. So yeah, that is how this page is going to look, and it's double-sided. I love that. Okay, now, Polaroids. I did decide to put these in white sleeves because I always prefer to do um, Polaroids in white sleeves. I don't know. It's just always been a personal preference. And I am just going to put them in order. There were two sets of Polaroids per member. And since there's no Tay... We just skip over him and start again with Namjoon on the bottom row, like this. Oops, a little crooked. 
We're gonna do something like this and then on the next page um, I'm going to put them in the middle because there's only three actual Polaroids left. I love this one of JK though. It is so cute. Like look at him. <laughs> and then there's stickers. I am going to put Tay's sticker in his own binder. So we just have six stickers which actually works out quite perfectly for this layout. All right. <laughs> I don't know. What do we think? I think it's okay. Um, it's fine. <laughs> So yeah, here is what we did. So yes, that is all I have then for my main BTS binder. And now I just need to grab Taehyung's binder. Okay, let's see what we need to do for Tae here. I'm kind of thinking about maybe putting the season's greetings IDs down here. I'm still not I'm fully convinced that I want to keep the season's greetings IDs like this. I was just sort of testing it out to see how, you know, I would like it. But yeah, I just, I don't know. <laughs> but I think I want to put this double-sided one there. And then we will put the random one up here. And then his Polaroids here in the middle like that. I don't know. It's just, I don't know if I like this layout or not. I'm not sure. And then I have his sticker. So I think I'm actually just going to put it here like this. And then it'll look like that. So we just sort of have this colorful um, middle column. So yes, that is all I have then for Taeyong's binder. So here is TXT. Oh boy, I think I'm going to need to go, yeah, literally towards the back. But let's just go ahead and plop these in. Okay, so these are the MOA by Together photo cards. They're fan live. This is number two. Yeah, we'll just go in order. Although it is just annoying when you have to try to store 10 photo cards. I don't know why Hybe always does this with their tour cards recently. But instead of eight, they've been doing 10. But, you know, it's whatever. My friend Melody, she commented on my unboxing video that it looks like Yeonjun works at Progressive, like the insurance company, and ever since then, like, I cannot unsee. <laughs> so thank you. <sighs> okay, uh, this is number seven. And then number eight, especially this one. <laughs> Doesn't it look like the progressive shirt? Anyways, oh my god. Okay, and then we have these two. These two are actually really, really cute. But yeah, I am going to need to put them on the back because um, I just really don't want to bring out another eight pocket just to put two photo cards in. So yeah. <laughs> okay, so there is that. And then, okay, so... I do not fully collect Subin anymore. However, <laughs> because we were really fortunate to get almost full sets of everyone. Oh no, these are getting mixed up. Um, but I am just going to put some of Subin's cards in here as well. And I don't know, I don't have his full set yet but I might try to complete it later. Um, I know that my friend Pamela is still waiting on her set to arrive, so I might do some trading with her if she is missing any Taeyeon or Bongyu because she double biases them. So yeah, we will see. Um, but either way, I don't know, I'm not going to like go out of my way to try to complete the set. We'll just see how it goes, but um, yeah, I don't know. I would not be doing this if I didn't have the majority of his cards already, like you know what I mean? <laughs> so yes, uh, this is number eight. And then, oh dear, a lot of my cards got mixed up in the box, so these are the special cards. Um, we have nine, this is number nine, number seven, here's number seven. Okay, so I'm missing number two, 
and then we have oh number one oh wait hold on this is this is a unit card okay and then we have number nine okay so i will put that one here at the top and so i'm basically just missing uh number two and ten does that sound right yeah i think so but again i'm not in like in a huge rush um to complete okay wow now let's do the individual special cards because i kind of forgot about those okay so i don't know if i'm going to like this but i kind of have this idea where um i have a couple of sets that aren't exactly going to fill a whole eight pocket so i don't know i was thinking maybe i'll just go in order like one two three four and then five with Huning Kai right here or actually maybe I should stop Huning Kai right here and then start over these were from the hoodie and we can do um, something like one two three oh wait you know what <laughs> this makes no sense We'll put Bomb Gyu with his other card and then Taeyun with his other card. So they're all kind of, you know, they're paired up with their own card, right? And then on this page, I'll put Hanin Kai up at the top because I just like individual cards at the top. Okay, and then I have solo, not solo, what am I saying? unit cards <laughs> we have pairings so okay let's see here i think it's like this something like this yes okay sure <laughs> and i don't think i'm gonna put these in order really but maybe it'll turn out to be that way who knows oh these pockets don't want to open I don't know I think that's kind of nice though I really like how the colors align that way and this way you know Hyunin Kai isn't like by himself or I'm not using a six pocket so that there's always going to be a gap with you know not having six members on one page so yeah I think this is fine for now um, and then like I said we'll look for Subin you know another time but yeah this is it then for TXT. Oh my goodness, you guys, I messed up. I forgot that I mixed up some cards in this box. So I still have some more Taeyang cards to put away. They're his D icon photo cards. I have this other Yanjun. <laughs> I have the boys. And then, yeah, we still have to go through all my 17 cards. So since I already got out my binder for the boys, I'm just gonna go ahead put away these cards and then we'll go back and bring out the other binders that I just put back up but it's okay <laughs> let's see oh here we go so yeah um now that I collect Hyunjae I have been slowly getting some of his other cards from past eras I'm not gonna completely I think try to replace you know my Kevin cards with with Hyunjae or anything like that but um, my friend Pamela happened to be running a group order for um, the limited edition for the only. So I was like, you know what, I'll just claim Hyunjae because it was just a good opportunity and it was a good price. So yeah, now he is going to go down here. And then, oh boy, we need to go quite far back now. So I think these are it. So we have the B Zone photo cards. Yes. Well, mostly. Not all, but oh my god, this is such a mess. I thought I was at least semi-organized before starting, but I was not. <laughs> okay, so I have this Eric one. So I'll put him down there. And then, um, what else? What else? I think I need... Oh, here we go. Youngoon, Youngoon, Youngoon. Um, Youngun special card, and then this one of Eric in the hoodie, and then oh my god, how cute is this? <laughs> have this one. 
Um, I think that is it. I'm only missing one, but I have a trade coming and it's international, so it'll probably take a while. But yeah, once I get that Youngoon, it'll be completed. Um, I also need to... Okay, I'm getting ahead of myself, but... Um, I have some Lepothesel cards with... Um, let's see, I, I'm trying to decide how I want to store these. So I have some Lepothesel here, <laughs> which I still need to complete Eric and Hyunjae, but I have their newer round of Lepothesel cards that my friend Ina held a group order for. So now I'm trying to decide, like... Do I just want to put them there? But I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I should start them on a brand new page, honestly. Okay, let's refill <laughs> uh, at least two more pages. But this binder, you know, every time I film one of these, I'm like, I think I need to get another The Boys binder because it is just getting, getting a bit out of control. <laughs> All right, so recently I did an unboxing for their OST song, Echo, and they actually gave us full photo card sets, like OT11, which is great, but I'm just gonna try to put them all, you know, on one page. But what I normally do in situations like this where I have a full OT11 set is I like to put my bias line in the middle, and I always go in the order of Youngun, Eric, and Hyunjae. I understand that's not age order in any way, shape, or form, <laughs> but because Eric's my main bias, I kind of like to put him in the middle. Um, and then, yeah, so that's just how I always do things. <laughs> and then after that, I'm gonna put the rest of the photo cards in age order. So hopefully that makes sense. <laughs> I know there's really no rule, but sometimes people like to ask, like, what's my reasoning behind, you know, the order that I put things in? I don't know. Sometimes people actually get offended or mad at the way you organize your binders, so, or who you collect. It's really, really weird <laughs> how people react. Uh, but, okay, now I have Hangyan and uh, Sunu, so I think I'm just going to put them here as a pair. Or another idea, actually, maybe I can put them like this and then I'll put the Lepothesol cards like this. Actually, you know what? We'll just go ahead and do that. Let's just do that. And then that way this page will fill out a little bit more. And, you know, we can, we can always change things, obviously. Yeah, I think that's it, except <laughs> for this one card that I need to put away for Maverick. Yeah, here it is. So this is for Mood. There's that. So, oh my gosh, I feel like I've been working forever on Maverick, but these final three are on the way. Okay, so that is it for the boys today. Alrighty, we brought out the TXT binder one more time. <laughs> um, so let's see, where do we want to put Yan June? My friend Pamela sent me this pop. It's a sticker for Chaotic Wonderland, and this is my Chaotic Wonderland page. So I think I'm gonna put him up here. And then I do have a unit card on the way, which will go down here. We're back with more Taeyong. <laughs> oh my goodness. I just cannot believe. Okay, so let's just start a brand new page for him. All right, like I said, we have the D icon cards that I needed to put away. Oh my gosh, I completely forgot about these. Yeah, my friends uh, did group orders for 17 and the btsd icon uh photo cards so yes um <laughs> there's so many there's a lot of him in this outfit and uh, i just need to show you this one because it just cracks me up so much like just look at it <laughs> it's so funny to me um but yeah, we're just gonna do this page like this. Unfortunately, the next page will not fill a nine pocket though, but we'll see what we can do. Can we just look at this for a minute? Like, <laughs> oh my God, he's so funny. But these are like the really close up ones. I think I'm probably just going to do a five pattern configuration for the time being. 
um, maybe we'll just do something like this. Sure, why not? I love the one of him with the red hair. And then we'll do the super close-up ones, I guess, in the middle row. <laughs> I don't know. And yeah. Okay, what do we think? D-icon, not bad, not bad. I do love how this fills out. Okay, I think we're for real done with all my BTS cards. Now we can finally move in. Oh, you know what? We need to move into and hype in. I have a few Jake cards to put away. So, oh my goodness, I really completely forgot that we have some Jake memories that we need to put away. And um, let's see, we have this and hype in essential card that needs to be put away as well so i think what i'm going to do is move out this one because it's a sticker and then i'm going to put the actual album photo card here in the middle oh my god i forgot i used white sleeves <laughs> let's switch that out completely forgot that for some of their albums i was using uh, white sleeves just so that it looked a little bit more uniform because not every photo card was the same size and then let's see how do I want to store then this photo card maybe um I'll just put him on the back for now I don't know we'll just do that for now okay so now moving into dimension answer I have uh, this Weverse pre-order benefit that I traded with my friend Pamela. So let's see, this is Target, I believe. Oh geez, I think I'm gonna put him up here um, in the middle. Yeah, is that how I wanna do this? Sure. <laughs> and we will just move this one over here. Yeah. So that is the Dimension Answer page, and then I need to go over to Memories. Here we go, my Memories page <laughs> is still pretty blank, but I pulled this one and then Melanie and Pamela helped trade with me uh, for the other two versions. So I am finally done collecting his memory set. Okay, so sorry for the abrupt ending. My battery died, so I had to swap it out with a fresh battery, but either way, I was already done at storing all my Jake cards. So now we are moving on into my little mini binders. This is my Kingdom collection. I mainly collect Shiyu, but I do have a few of the other members in here as well. But uh, today I am just going to be storing away two cards. I have um, his Kingdom Anniversary card, which is so pretty. And his card is actually a little bit wider than all of the regular photo cards. So thankfully it fits, but it's very, very snug. And then the group order manager that I got this card from also included Jahan. And he's my third bias anyway, so I'm like, yeah, sure. We will go ahead and store him in here as well <laughs> but that is all then that I have for Kingdom. So now it is finally time for all the 17 cards. This section is probably going to be quite long because I did a Baiyi haul which was pretty much like 100% or 99.9% 17. So we're going to start out with my Joshua collection. These that I have in my hand are all of the album cards. And am I right? Hold on, let me double check. <laughs> yes, I have a stack here for album cards and then I have a stack here for non-album, which is gonna go in his other binder. <laughs> so let's just go ahead and get started. I actually filmed a vlog where I prepped this binder. So that was what I did mostly in that vlog. I was just sort of prepping everything. Like I have uh, his Boys B cards here. So let's just put him away. I try to put everything in order. <laughs> and by the way, um, I have links to most of the supplies that I use often uh, linked below in the description. Okay, here we have LNL, yes love and letter go 
go like this. Okay, so now for going 17, I will put his two solo ones up here. Oh my gosh, the lighting in this video, I am so sorry. It is such a cloudy day today and my camera just doesn't really want to cooperate. <laughs> and then I have a unit card and then I just need the one of him and DK. I technically already have that photo card, but that one is actually going into DK's binder. So yeah, I'm probably gonna just hunt the other one down so I can put it in here. But I've also been thinking about maybe combining their photo cards into one binder, but I'm still holding on to that thought. I'm not going to do it quite yet. I think it would look nicer to do it once I have all of their photo cards, but I'm not really close to being done yet. So we're gonna hold off on that for a bit. Okay, so now we have Teenage. Here we go. I have white. This one is the green one. So there is a teen age and then we have director's cut. I have none for the You Make My Day and Dawn. We have, we don't have any of those. <laughs> I really need to work on that. Now we're gonna move into an ode. And even though I already had some of them in the binder, I decided just to remove all of them and reorganize all of them. So we're gonna put them all together, like all four of the poet is gonna go on one, you know, and so forth. So let's get started. We're just going to go like this. So there's the first one. So I guess we'll do the colorful ones on the top row and then the white ones on the bottom. Right, so here's real and then real with the black on the back. Cute. <laughs> oh my gosh, I love this. I love how this is turning out. Okay, we have begin and then the ones with the white on the back. Looking good, that was begin, and now we have truth. Okay, and is this the last one? Do I need to add more pages? Oh my gosh. Actually, I think we're good. <laughs> and then we just have hope. So cute. We love the little beret. So there is an ode, oh my gosh. This really, really filled out the binder once we put these in. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy that I can finally relax because we don't need to worry about it anymore. <laughs> All right, and then I got Hengere, which um, I'm almost done with, I'm almost done. So we'll put these two up here. Okay, <laughs> and then I need to put this one away. So I'm actually only missing one more. Wait, actually I have that on the way. That's on the way, so it'll go there. So Hengere will be finished. All right, now we need to go into your choice because I have these two pobs. So they're gonna go in here. Oh, this is so pretty. I love this page. Okay, and then Ataka. I was missing the last one, OP1. So that can go there. Oh my gosh, how is dust getting into here? This is so annoying. <laughs> Please. Okie dokie. So we are still in Ataka era. Oh, I have a pob, so we'll put him here. And then we just have some Japanese cards. And at the moment, they are in the back. I feel like once I get more of those cards, I can, I can, you know, I can um, organize it a little bit better. But I'm gonna put these two here, like this. And then we just have this one, this one from, I can't remember if this is from Weavers, but you know what? I think I just want to put it back here for now 
and then once I add another page I can move him over so you know what not bad I feel like we made so much progress with his binder I kind of want to flip through it a little just to see how I did it is just a little sad that day and dawn is just so empty here but I'm just trying to wait till I can find someone selling a set because buying them individually and paying for you know shipping postage whatever for each one just doesn't make a lot of sense to me so I would like to try to get them in bulk as much as possible anyways here is the rest Oh my gosh, Attacka is done! Attacka is done! Oh, I'm so happy. We love this. Okay, and then Power of Love. All right, now let's go on to what do we have next? Um, his non-album binder. Okay, here we go. Let's start out. Um, I did prep these as well, so all the pages should be in here. We are going to start out with these Haru cards. Now, I know that not every single thing is in order per se, but you know what? We're just going to go with it. <laughs> and if I need to redo anything off camera, then I will do that. Let's actually... Should I do it like this? I don't know. That is so cute though. I love the backs. I'm really glad that I ended up switching out the white sleeves for the clear ones because seeing the backs of these really are like just so nice. <laughs> and okay. So Haru is done. Okay, now we have some of these Carrot Land. So let's see, this is from 2019, I think. I love these colors. Hmm, let's see. I like this one. It has a bit of pink to contrast with the other ones. And then, yeah, that works. And then we'll put these two here. And we have this really adorable one with Joshua and Vernon. So cute. Okay. Now, how am I doing Carrot Land 2020? Okay, so I think I'm skipping this. I can't remember exactly like how I was going to do this, <laughs> but I think I was just gonna start like a brand new page, something like that, I don't know. And we'll put his solo ones here. And then we have the two pairs here and a group card. And we'll worry about fillers later. Sorry, this is sliding around everywhere. But I have some of his uh, 2020 Carrot Land. Okay, so 2020 Carrot Land is done, except for the cards that are pairs, which I'm not even going to worry about anymore. <laughs> um, what else? I have this incomplete card, like so. And what else? What else do we have here? Oh, we have Carrot Land and Concert DVDs, The Fact. And these two are... Um, carrot membership kits okay can't exactly remember where i wanted to put these <laughs> oh dear okay i think i put these sheets in for his d icon to put it together with these so i think this is what i reserve for d icon oh my gosh i cannot remember So we'll just put D icon here. Is this gonna be enough? I don't think I took into account. Oh, this extra one. Oh shoot. Okay. Um let me think here. How do I want to do this? Put these ones here. These are really cute. Hmm. 
what do I want to do with this really cute unit card? Um, let's see, you know what? It can go right here. <laughs> Perfect. Okay, that worked out. That worked out. I'm going to go ahead and put these concert ones up here. These are my two absolute favorites favorites so I want to put them on the top I know these are not in any order but I don't really care my camera was going out of focus I, I'm sorry about that all right um, next page at the moment I'm really not quite sure how I want to organize membership kit stuff honestly I don't know but we have four cards here so <laughs> I'm just gonna go ahead and put them all on this page and I'll worry about organizing it later. There we go. So here's what the backs look like. And oh my goodness, you know what? I forgot I had these HMV cards. <laughs> oh no. Let's see if we can find a random spot to shove these in. <laughs> I just don't know where to put these. Yeah, you know what? There's two spots here. Let's just put them here. The end. I'll worry about it later. <laughs> so now I am on to my DK collection. We are going to start out with his album cards first. So I need to go over here. Okay, so I haven't reorganized this yet. His cards are still like back to back, which I might end up changing. I haven't quite decided yet, but either way. We will go ahead and put these away up here. And then, yeah, this is the other card that I was talking about that I need to put into Joshua's binder as well. All right, so now I have AL1, and I think we'll just put them like this. Oops. Did not realize I had sleeves in there. Okay not bad that's filling out happy about that okay now we have teenage i think i am finished with his we just need to put all of them up here and i don't think i have fillers in here do i no i do not oops this is really crooked i want to fix that <laughs> This page is going to be for director's cut, which I do not have. And then um, this is going to be, I think, for You Make My Day. Yes. Luckily, I do have all of them. So we will start putting all these away. Let me make sure I don't have any fillers in here. In no particular order, we're just going to have all the ones that match just be together. And then once I get You Made My Dawn, I'm probably going to do two here and then the rest here. I already have one. I have no idea what on earth this page is for. I don't know why I put that there. Um, or maybe I was just going to do You Made My Dawn here and here and then leave these blank. I honestly can't remember, but I don't know. Um, I'll just leave that blank. <laughs> okay, and now we're going to pass over an ode because we already finished and I need to complete his attacka with this one. This is my final attacka card that I needed. Yay! <laughs> and then I just need to go to the back for Power of Love, which is this and... Oh, I have two actually oh my gosh i actually forgot i have this attack of pob as well so did i leave any space for that maybe i didn't hmm <laughs> oh i remember now okay so i think i will put these here like that because i kind of like how they crisscross um and then on this page is where I will just put the extra 
um, pop as well as I think this was the Weaver's photo card for Power of Love. So yeah, he will go right there. Okay, so that is all I have then for his album cards. And now I need to go to his other binder and put away the non-album cards. I feel like we are finally in the home stretch. We have a lot of his D-icon, um, so I'm gonna put them in the back though, I think, or at least with the other D-icon cards. But I will put away uh, these. These were the 2019 Carrot Land. So kind of similar to how we did Joshua's, right? Do something like this. Okay, and then this page we just have uh, three cards, is that right? Yeah, three cards to put away. How adorable is this one of him and Wanu? So cute, I absolutely am in love with it. So, do that. And then this one of him with Ming Hao, and then this one with Wanu. <laughs> so cute. So what else here? I have this really random OTU card, and he's wearing a blue outfit, so it kind of matches. I am just going to put it there right now, like as a placeholder. I think I was going to put this here, as well as this here, because it is from the most recent Carrot Land. Um, I might move them though once my uh, photo cards come in from Melanie's group order. Once those come in, I might move these to be with those photo cards. But yeah, until then, this is fine. Okay. Oh, and then I have uh, this DVD from Incomplete. The DVD photo card, I mean. This is Blu-ray. That's DVD. And then I have, uh, I don't know where to put this. This is from the new membership kit. Kind of matches though. Okay, what else? I think the rest of these are all D icon. And then I have these two um, DVD photo cards. I don't think I have much of a choice right now. I'm just going to put them back here. So I think I want to put the new D icon photo cards over here next to his older ones. Like see how like these are almost identical. So let's just do that. I love this one with the teddy bear. So cute. All right. And then these can go on the back. How funny is this one? <laughs> oh my gosh, I think that's it then for DK. Is that all we have today? Well, not really. I do have a little bit more that I need to put away. But this binder is finished for now. <laughs> okay. Okay, so basically I just need to put away some things into these collect books. These were just the rest of the Carrot Land set that came with the DVD. Or actually, no, not the DVD. This was with the Digi Code. That's right, this was the digital code set. Um, anyways, I am going to put each member into this collect book. And I have a super duper mini little Vernon collection. Yeah, very, very tiny. <laughs> but I'm going to put him into his own little binder. So yeah, there is not much going on in this binder. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> Ta-da! That is all I have in my teeny tiny Vernon collection. And then this is just kind of a whole hodgepodge, really, of, of photo cards. Um, so we will just go in order here. I love the backs of these two. June and Hoshi. Uh oh, this wants to bend. Oh boy, come on. <laughs> Fighting for its life. Then Ming Hao, and then Boo, and then a Dino. So yeah, that is how I store some of my extra cards that I still, you know, want to hold on to. And yeah, they just sort of chill in this little collect book. And yeah, I'm just really happy with it. 
and I just have this little uh, Polaroid from Seasons Greetings <laughs> um, of Mingyu in the front. So we have reached the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching and I do apologize if I sounded a bit low energy. I just haven't been feeling well and I had some dental work done so just talking hurts. <laughs> but I do hope that you enjoyed this though and I hope you have a great day and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!